Hi everybody, this is uh, Silvio Canto in Dallas, Texas on Sunday, April the 15th, and welcome to our video commentary. You know, the big story, at least today, it seems like there's a new big story every day, but the one today, of course, is uh, the, the new book by ex-director of the FBI, Mr. Jim Comey, and he's going to be making some television appearances. That's what, that's what authors do, so uh, nothing wrong with that. Uh, the publisher is obviously teasing uh, the readers with bits and pieces of, of the book, and that's what publishers do, so nothing really new there. But the bottom line is, is there anything in this book that is new? And I have not read it. I don't think anybody has read it other than a small group of people who are going to interview him. I don't believe it is available yet for sale. I could be wrong on that. But I think obviously the publisher is looking for people to order the book based on some of these bits and pieces of, of information here and there. People who've read the book, and I'm specifically talking about Chris Wallace, who will be interviewing uh, the author, the author of Mr. Comey. Basically, they're saying there's nothing in the book. I mean, there's some interesting stories, obviously, but there's nothing in the book that is going to add anything new to the controversy between Mr. Trump, President Trump, and Mr. Comey, former Director Comey. There's really nothing new, nothing new at all. And in fact, some of the reviews that I've, I've heard of the book, you know, people who have commented on the book and, and some of the things that Mr. Comey is saying are basically saying that it was a good thing that he got fired. I thought it was interesting. Professor Alan Dorshowitz of Harvard Law School, who's been on TV recently, made some very nasty remarks and very negative remarks about Mr. Comey. Look, we'll read the book eventually. The book will come out. I'll, I'll order the book and, and get a copy and tell you what I think of it. But I don't think I'm going to be able to tell you anything more than what I'm telling you now. And that is, I'm, I'm sure it's going to be an interesting story. I'm sure that Mr. Comey had a very interesting life. But at the end of the day, there's nothing new to the story between Mr. Trump and Mr. Comey. And I have to tell you, just my gut reaction here, just my gut reaction, when you see the way that Mr. Comey's behaving and some of the things that he's saying, I think it's a good thing that he got fired. I really do. I think it's a good thing that he got fired. And uh, I can tell you that without having to, to read the book. So you're going to see a lot of Mr. Comey here in the next few weeks or so as he goes around some of the shows. But again, I don't think there's anything new here. I don't think there's anything that is going to change uh, the story in any, significant, uh, in any significant way. Thank you for watching. We have all of these at YouTube. We have them on Twitter. And we have them on my blog. Good day, everybody. Happy April 15th. This is not tax day in the United States because it falls on a Sunday. I guess that's going to be tomorrow. So hope you got your taxes in. Bye-bye, everybody. Good night.